Your liver is a very important organ that does a lot of things to keep you healthy. One of the things that it does is it produces glucose. Now, glucose is the main source of energy for your body, but sometimes your body needs more glucose than what's available in your bloodstream. And so that's where the liver comes in. The liver can produce glucose and then release it into your bloodstream when you need it. Now, remember that one of the issues with type 2 diabetes is insulin resistance. So this doesn't mean that there's not enough sugar in the bloodstream, but what happens is your cells become less responsive to that sugar and your cells are unable to take this sugar into the cell. And so the cells start releasing signs that say to the body, I need more sugar, I need more energy for the tasks that I have to do today. And the liver will receive this signal and it will understand that it needs to start producing glucose. Now the liver produces sugar through a process called gluconeogenesis. This process starts with the breakdown of non-carbohydrate compounds such as amino acids from proteins, lactate from muscles, and glycerol from fats. These compounds are converted into glucose which is then released into the bloodstream. Now, the main function of gluconeogenesis is to provide glucose to the brain and to other tissues that need it. Importantly, your brain does not have a way of storing glucose. And so your brain needs this supply of glucose in order to maintain its proper function.